In this lesson, you will learn about plotting coordinate pairs. So we have a coordinate grid here. It starts with zero, and each line going to the right goes up one number, and each line going up goes up one number. So one to six, and this one goes one to seven. This grid could keep going, but we're just using part of the grid. When you plot a coordinate pair, you have two numbers. The first number is always on the x-axis, or the, the we go across first, we go to that number first. The second number is how far up we go. So we go across first and then up. I like to think of it as an elevator. You have to, if there are three elevators, you have to decide which elevator you're going to get into before you can go up. So we can think of this as seven different elevators. You have to get into an elevator before you can go up to the floor you want. So the first number is always across, second number is up. So we simply look at our first number as three. So we go to the three on the x-axis. And this is the two, so we go up two. So three is our first, up to two. So we got in the third elevator and went to the second floor. In this case, we're going to get into the sixth elevator. The six is on the x-axis. And we're going to go up to the fourth floor. One, two, three, four. Okay. Well, this look, these are the same numbers, but they're in different order that affects where it gets plotted. In this case, I'm gonna go over to the fourth elevator and go up to the sixth floor. So six, four is over here, but the coordinate pair four, six is up there. They're different. Here's one with a zero. Zero means, I guess we're not getting into an elevator. We're taking, I don't, I don't know. But we stay on this Y axis and we go up to the five. So zero, five, four, six, six, four, and three, two. Those are all different plots, different points on this coordinate grid. That's the end of our lesson on plotting coordinate pairs.